one's still above. Oh, it's just cruel. Cruel bad. Still above. Reload game! Whoop! Thank you. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. Chase it. No. Oh my god. Please. Oh, this is going to be a terrible push. But I'm here for it. Better be close. Okay. More sport in here. The guy above. Oh, he's on the roof roof. Forgot you could even get up there. Tactical gaming. Tactical gaming. See ya. You can't even be mad. You can't even be mad at that one, but welcome yourselves back to some Modern Warfare 3 beta gameplay. Here. On a state. Never thought to see the day. It's actually not that bad of a time. You know what? We've been gaming. We've been ranking things up. Getting all the attachments I can unlocked. I still think there's work to be done, though. I still think there are attachments I can get to speed up this sniper a little bit. Gotta use an AR. Gotta use a submachine gun, something like that. But there are men's around here. Got one at the range. There's two at the range. Three at the range. Whoop. Drone out. Yo, old school. Old school. Don't let me do it to you. He's been bamboozled. He didn't think I had the spots back from Modern Warfare 2019. 2019. I'm on about the wrong game here. 2009. He didn't think I had the spots. We are using the KV. Inhabitor, the only sniper I, uh, I can use in the beta right now. If you pre-ordered like the Vault Edition or something on PlayStation, you can use the Longbow, which is like a 25 round mag, fast ADS. Don't let me turn again. Oh my lord, <laughs> it's actually broken. I mean, if you saw my video from COD Next, you know, when I was out in LA, I used that on Rust and my god, that is a match made in heaven. But I'm loving it. I'm enjoying it. I wish... There was a bolt action sniper though on the beta for us all to try. I used a bolt action. The cat AMR, something like that. But that thing was beefy in Warzone. So I don't really know how it's going to work in multiplayer. I'm a little worried. I'm going to be honest with you that the bolt actions just aren't going to compete again. I mean, these are technically sniper rifles, these two guns here. So it's not like it's going to be another marksman rifle meta like it was on Modern Warfare 2. But it makes me a little bit uneasy, you know. I'm a bolt action man at heart. And I'm sure a lot of you guys are. And to know that the semi-autos might rule supreme again. I mean, I know the SAB and the MK2 weren't semi-auto but they may as well have been they were that fast all right so i need to get those two attachments to make this good a bit better and then we can really get a feel for it you know see how the red gun shot is shall we whoa oh the time to kill forgot about that forgot about that one <laughs> gotta get used to this 150 health i know we're in for sniping but i need those attachments so give me a minute One. There's another. One outside. See you later, bud. I'm just getting my attachments. There it is, level nine. Give me my mass sniper rifle. So we've got the hand stop on there for ADS sprint to fire. And then we've got the laser unlocked, ready to go. Looks like we're getting absolutely peppered here, though. But Rust should be a good place to, to show you how snappy it is with those attachments. And now we're feeling it, huh? Uh oh. He bet you got the other guy for me? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, you can tell the difference already, right? Look how snappy it is now. Hold on. Oh, my God. I'm up top. I'm up top in this spot. What year are we in? What year are we in, folks? Whoop. Spore kill. Spore kill. Get the reloaded. So we're climbing. Sorry. Someone's going to do it, all right? Someone's going to be up here. Why can't it be me? Why can't it be me? What are you? You're not coming up these ladders, bud. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. No. <laughs> no. No. You can't let it happen. I mean, you can. It's happening to you. Just going to embrace it. Oh, the nade right on my forehead. That just shows you how good sniping can be in the right hands. And I'm just a little worried that all these semi-autos 
that we've got in the, in the beta right now that they're just going to be just too dominant compared to the other snipers. Not too dominant in the game. I think sniping is probably in a really good spot at the moment because the time to kill's slower. That means a one-shot gun should be more powerful. But with the amount of flinch in the game right now, I think it's balanced at the moment. But I think when that bolt action gets added to the game, if the ADS speed isn't the same as this, some people might think that's way too overpowered, but the fire rate is what made these guns good. The damage is a little shaky, so if you have a one-shot sniper or a one-shot the majority of the time and you still give it a good ADS, then it'll be fun to use. But like, as we've seen in the past, Modern Warfare 2, the core sniper rifles with the high damage just never have the best ADS. So that's when people use the marksman rifles. They need that fast ADS speed to keep up with the time to kill or with the demons with skill-based matchmakers. So my fingers are crossed right now. So when the full game does come out, those bolt action snipers can hold their own. That's all I could ask for. That way you have the choice between fire rate or damage and you never have to sacrifice aim down sight speed. Does that make sense? Like it lets you decide to pick a sniper that can take out multiple targets with its fire rate, but you have the risk of hit markers or you pick a heavy hitter that'll pretty much one shot every time, but you'll struggle with against multiple enemies. Am I crazy or does that make sense? I am peace it, folks. Go on, we'll keep going. Reload, reload, reload. Got UAV as well, we'll slap it down. Uh oh. Uh oh, another one of my worries though is this laser. I mean, I know we're playing a limited version of the game right now. It's the beta. You don't have access to, you know, all the guns, all the equipment, all the attachments, but I'm hoping this laser isn't the only one that is good on the snipers, you know, because it's constantly visible. It reminds me of like a hip fire build for a pistol or a submachine gun. Like this is horrifying. I mean, maybe that's their way to balance it. So, you know, that someone's come around the corner with a side rifle. And I'm all for one being there when I'm scoped in. They know I'm there, you know. They're not going to pee. They're going to shut the door. That's fine. I get it. But when it's here at the hip and I'm just walking around, no wonder I bloody YY so much. Woo! Got your head. Yeah, hold that. Hold that right in your forehead. <laughs> Whoa, it's one behind me. Gotcha. Another one upstairs, I think. Oh, they're all upstairs. We got one on the flank here. Got him. Got him. Got him. Woo! And you waited, no! Well, as you can tell, folks, in a nutshell, I'm having a great time. If you sum it up, summarizing Modern Warfare 3 sniping, I think it's in a good spot. You've got slide cancelling. You've got reload cancelling. You've got red dots on the minimap. You've got vote to skip. I mean, the game overall is such a big improvement from Modern Warfare 2. And to slap some good old-fashioned satisfying sniping in there as well. I mean, I'm all for it, you know. Is it good enough to bring me back? As you all know, I gave up on a multiplayer this year. I went to Warzone and I was done with it. They seem to have given us everything that we would have wanted. So if they sort some things out, you know, little, little picky things like the kill feed lasts a bit too long. If you're going for sniping clips, you want it to be a bit more rewarding. So you want it to be a bit quicker. The kills fade off a bit quicker so you can be pushing and chasing. If it's a bit too long, it allows for like less exciting clips. But that's just being picky, you know? Bolt actions need to be banging. The flinch when you get shot, I know it's a little bit of an iffy one. I think it's fine. It's obviously annoying, but like, I think it's balanced. But I'm sure a lot of you guys would disagree as well. But let me know in the comments your thoughts, your overall first impressions of Modern Warfare 3 sniping. It may be an incredible year but for now it's just a beta we're just having fun we're testing things and i'm having a cracking time hopefully you all enjoy the video my friends and i'll see you in the next one